Good day, guys. Welcome back to the King's Tutorial class. In today's video, we'll be looking at calculus, under which we'll be looking at differentiation and integration. Now, under differentiation, we'll be looking at a series, okay, which we'll always be looking at uh, differentiation in the first principle, we'll be looking at product rule, we'll be looking at functional functional theory, we'll be looking at quotient rule, we'll be looking at exponential function, trigonometric function, or limit functions, and some other functions that we'll under differentiation. Then, we'll now move on to integration. But for differentiation, under using the uh, differentiation using first principle, I'm going to listen some steps that I want to what, take so you can easily answer questions on that what, the position is the first principle. Okay, so now the steps are given that y is equal to x, the first step I have to do is what add the increment of y to y and add the increment of x to x, which becomes what y plus theta y equals to what x plus theta x. That's the first step. And the second step is what to subtract y from both sides. Okay, which that becomes what y plus theta y minus y. Okay, where the y both cancels out on the left hand side. Equals to what? X plus theta x minus what? Minus y. What thing you have to do is to do what? Substitute the value of y into the right hand side. Now, where the equation is still what? Theta y equals to what? X plus theta x minus y. Y from the question, we have our y to be equal to what? To be equal to x. So, our right hand side becomes what? Uh, x plus theta x minus what? Minus x. In which case, on my right hand side, our theta x. Our x what comes out. Now the next step I have to do is what substitute, so uh, bring out the value, the common value or the common term on the right hand side, which is theta x. So that becomes what theta y over theta x equals to what theta x over theta x. In which case, uh, theta y over theta x now becomes what one. Okay. Therefore, the y dx is equals to what is equals to is equals to one. So the differential of what y equals x is equals to what is equals to one. As how to solve questions uh, using first principle. If you've not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do want to subscribe to my YouTube channel and put on your notification button so you can receive notification as we upload new videos. Now, example one. Given that y is equal to x squared, find the differential of the y dx. In which case, what we're going to do in this case is to work. So apply those two steps that I have listed earlier on. Okay, now the question is what? y is equal to what? x squared. Now, the first thing you have to do is to add the increment of y to y and the increment of x to x, which this question can be written as y equals to what? x all squared. Now, adding the increment becomes what? y plus theta y equals to what? x plus what? theta x. The power is still there. Now, that's the first step. So, after adding the increment of x to x and the increment of y to y, Next thing you have to do is to what? Subtract y from both sides, which becomes what? y plus what? Delta y minus y is equal to what? x plus delta x all squared. Okay? And that's and y. Now, this cancels out. What are we left with? Delta y equals to what? Now, expanding this, okay, you can either use, uh, you can either expand it normally or you use Pascal triangle to expand it. It becomes what? It becomes x squared plus what? 2x theta x okay plus what theta x squared after expanding it minus what minus y now in which case we're going to have that what uh okay now the next step was to do is what we have to subtract we have to add the value of y from the question into uh, our right hand side we have become what theta y equals to what x squared plus what 2x theta x plus what theta x squared minus our uh, y is what? x squared in that case. Now, it cancels out. Okay? So what are we left with? Theta y is equal to what? 2x theta x. Okay? Plus what? Theta x squared. Okay? Now, what I want to do next? What to what? to bring out theta x from the right hand side. Okay? Because the x here is what? It's common. Which becomes what? Theta y over what? Theta x. Equals what? 2x theta x. I mean, equals what? Theta x into 2x plus what? Theta x. When you move on theta x from here, you will never want theta x. So, after bringing out theta x from the right hand side, you have to divide by theta x side and what? Cancel out. That's why we divide this left hand side also by what? By theta x. In which case, we have a theta y. Theta y to be equal to what? 2x plus what? Theta x. 
Now, I forgot to add. The next thing I have to do in this case is to do what? Is to turn your data x to what? To zero. Is to what? Turn your data x to what? Zero. And to the right data x, you put what? You put zero. In which case, what about data y over data x? So be equals to two x plus what? Plus zero. Which leaves our answer the y in x to be equals to what? Two x. Now, we now apply that what? The differential of y equals x squared is equals to what? Is equals to two x. Example 2. Given that y is equal to 3x squared minus 5x, find the differential of what? y with respect to what? With respect to x. In which case, y is equal to 3x squared uh, minus 5x. Applying our steps, first is what? Add the increment of y to y. Okay? And add the increment of what? x to x minus 5 into what? x plus delta x. So wherever I see x, you add the increment of x to it. Wherever I see y, you add the increment of y to it. Which in our left hand side, we have y only once, which is this. And for our right hand side, we have x to appear here. Okay? And it is squared. And we have x also appear here. So I'm going to add the increment of x to that x also. Now, that's the first step. Second step is what? Subtract y from both sides, which becomes what? Delta y, after subtracting from both from the left hand side, equals what? 3 into what? x plus delta x. Okay? All squared minus 5 into what? x plus what? Delta x minus y. Now, that is that. Third step, you have to add what? I mean, you have to substitute the value of y in the question to what? What we have as our y on the right hand side on the board. In which case, I'm going to add that delta y is equal to what? 3 into, expanding this becomes what? x squared plus what? 2x delta x. Okay? Plus what? Delta x squared. Okay? Minus, expanding this becomes what? 5x. Minus 5x minus what? 5 delta x. Then minus, our y in the equation is what? 3x squared minus what? 5x. 3x squared minus what? Minus 5x. Now, solving. Delta y is equal to what? Expand this, that becomes what? 3x squared, okay, plus what, 6x theta x, okay, plus what, 3 theta x squared, okay, minus what, 5x minus 5 theta x, okay, minus 3x squared, plus 5x, plus 5x. Now, looking at it, 3x squared, now that's what, 3x squared, okay, uh, minus 5x, now that's what, plus 5x. And that should be all for now. Then, delta y is now equal to what? 6x plus what? 6x delta x, I mean, plus what? 3 delta x squared, okay? And that's 5 delta x, and that's all. The next step is what? Uh, bring out the x from the right hand side, because it's common. And divide both sides by what? The x. It becomes delta y over delta x, equals to what? Delta x into 6x plus what? 3 delta x, okay, minus 5, all over what delta x, in which case, this was cancel out. Next step, what we have to do is what? To turn our delta x to 0, which becomes what? Delta y over delta x, turn it to 0, is going to be equal to what? 6x plus 3 into 0, minus what? Minus 5, okay? Finally, the y dx in this case is equal to what? 6x minus what? Minus 5. Okay, so my the y, my dy dx from this question, y equals 3x minus 5 is what? 6x minus what? Minus 5. Thanks for watching that video. In our next series, we'll be looking at how to use function or function or theory to solve questions in what? In differentiation. So, from there, we'll now to product rule, quotient rule, and the other one I named earlier. So if you've not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please also subscribe and hit your notification bell as we'll be giving you updates on our new videos. Thank you.